Did you know that you can bring images to life using this very simple tool and completely for free? Yes, Liapix is a website that does these depth animations for any kind of static image and it is very, very sick. I'll show you how to do it right now. All right, so now that we are on their website, it will be linked down in the description below. Liapix, all we have to do is just sign in over here. And once we're signed in, I'll show you how to get over the next steps. So as you can see, Liapix is actually a very simple tool to use. All we need to do is either drag and drop a picture or click on this upload button in the top left. So if I open up this picture, this is what I got from Mid Journey. Uh, a few weeks ago when I made when I was making the mid journey video. So it's a very simple image. It's fully static. We're cut. We're just gonna uh, drag and drop it right here and look at the magic in just a few seconds. We have a depth animation. We have a picture that is coming to life. As you can see, it's moving right there. We can change the animation length if we want to, you know, one second. So it does this like woo, 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 zoom in effect. We can do six seconds. So it's a bit slower. I, I like it like five seconds or so uh and then we can change animation style if we want to go horizontal if you want to go vertical uh you know a circle whatever you want there's also a perspective which is very nice as well very unique amount of motion you can go with less regular or more i like it where it's uh you know like regular or even less where it's like subtle i don't want it to go too much or too far i think it's kind of dumb focus point can either have it uh you know super close or you know far or center i like to have a center because of the eyes uh we have the edge dilation uh, as well we can change that if we want uh and it changes like this uh this edge around the image and then on the advanced editor we can play around the amplitude and the the phase xyz so whatever movement we want to have and that is basically it that's how you can make a depth image so if we turn all of these off, we can just, you know, have this image right here. And if we want to share it, we can share it on any social media we want. Or you can save it as a GIF, MP4 or a LIF. So there's a lot of these different save options. All you have to do is just click on a share button. And as you can see, it is completely for free. So if I want to get another image, all I have to do is just refresh or I can drop another image, which I have right here of another mid journey art that I got. So as you can see, this looks very sick in my opinion, especially if you go with something like vertical and it moves up and down and it looks like her head is just nodding with this like subtle movement, you know, not too fast. We go with, uh, you know, five seconds or even, even four seconds to six seconds It's very nice. We can save it, have it uploaded on any kind of website you can upload it on Twitter, on Instagram. I think it looks very sick on Instagram, especially when it's a one-to-one -one image. And overall, you can enjoy these, uh, you know, depth images. Very simple tutorial. Like I said, doesn't take you more than like, what, 30 seconds? And you're set. As you can see, that was a very short tutorial, but I hope it helped you out. If you got this far into the video, make sure to drop a like. And if you haven't already seen my mid-journey guide, you can check it out right over here. Anyway, if you don't already know, I do stream on Twitch three days a week. Link is down in the description below, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, and have a good one. Bye-bye.